Samsung TV UN 70 TU700 DF This is the TV here uh, When I was taking it apart it looked like someone Maybe the technician that who bring it here uh, I can see from the mark here that someone was trying to take it apart or already took it apart maybe replacing the board with no luck so this is what the TV is doing when I plug it to the power you can see the light goes off the TV is trying to turn on Here, the backlight, and the same thing. The TV keep looping, then it turns on. And this look like we have the display. Yeah, we have the display. So let's look closely to the screen. So the picture looks okay when the TV is on. I don't see no lines, no dead uh, pixels. It looks so uh, good. Still like uh, the TV have a problem. Look. I unplug it and plug it back again. Yeah, there is a backlight I can see. The backlight is a little bit dim. Yeah, it's uh, yes. This is taking a long time to turn on. I'm sure now the TV is looping. And that's what it is. You can see the backlight, the TV tries to turn on, then goes off. Sometime when I press or I touch one of these capacitors, The TV is going to turn on and stay on. Yeah, now I can't get it to turn on. You can see the backlight, it's go on, but I don't hear the Samsung sound, and we have no picture. We are going to disconnect the screen from the main board, and we are going to see if the TV is going to turn on from the first try. The backlight is going to tell us if the TV is on. So there is a backlight. Here the backlight go bright. We did hear the Samsung sound. And the TV turns on, stay on. Look, the backlight is on. So when the screen is unplugged, the TV turns on, stay on. There is a chance could be a bad backlight when the TV go full bright, the TV goes off. Let's try the something. So we unplug the main board and now the power board is on the on mode. All the voltages, all functions of the power board is on the on mode. Even the backlight is going to run in the full uh, power. You can see the backlight is bright and stable. So this is not a backlight issue. 
And look like definitely is not a main board issue because we have, when we disconnect the screen, the TV turns on from the first try. So this screen, it has three sections from there to over here. There is one. Then there is one in the middle to here, and there is the other one all the way to over there. Between this panel board, there is a flex cable transferring the power lines and the data lines from this side to this side. The same thing this one. So we are going to unplug just one side. Let's start with this one. We turn on the TV. You can see the backlight now. So the TV turns on from the first try. Are we going to have any kind of the pictures? No, we don't have no picture. Yeah, we don't have any kind of the picture. The backlight is all the way on. So let's plug this one back. We unplug this one here, this side. And we're going to see if we have any, any kind of the picture. Same thing the TV is trying to turn on. Yeah, it turns on from the first try. I did hear the Samsung sound. So the TV is on and staying on. But no picture at all. There's no health, but no picture. So at the moment, yeah, I don't know which side is uh, causing the problem. So we're going to start with this side. We cover some choices, and we see if, uh, if anything is going to change. So let's connect this one back. So all the connectors connected, and we're going to start from this one, start covering the traces. So we are just going to use the, the tape that is not thick. So let's just cut like a 3 millimeter, just something small. And we're going to start covering the big uh, traces, that's a power line. The small traces, that's a data line. So we start from the first, like this. We cover the first four or so. So I'm going to tell you if I see the picture or no picture. So you did hear the Samsung sound. There is no picture. And you can see the backlight over there. It turns on from the first try. So covering these traces, the TV turns on and they stay on from the first try, but no picture. So let's go a little bit farther
Uh, backlight is on. TV goes off. So when we cover the traces, we back to the to the first problem. Let's go a little bit more. Just watch the backlight here. Yeah, the TV goes off. So I'm going to keep going. Then I tell you the, the result in the end. So we don't make the video long. So I want all the way to the other side of the tape of the flex cable covering. I try to cover. Uh, all the traces but still uh, no picture so we are going to go to the this side You can watch the backlight from here. So the TV turns on, it's staying on. Still no picture. Let's go next. going about like three four traces at the time okay I have some kind of the picture now you see it so we have like this white screen we didn't have one like that or we have some picture but the picture is washed out so there is uh, no colors so look like we are on the right uh, right track to get this TV to work So let's move just a little bit, like this is the only option which comes to the bed screen. The TV goes off, then back on. And keep looping. Let's 
to shred this one. So a TV goes off. Alright, I do have a picture now. You can see there is a picture, but look like there is some lines and devil image over there. But we do have a picture. So we keep going like this till we find where is the past spot. We have the clear picture. So I'm going to keep doing it and uh, we'll show you in the end what, what traces I covered. So let me show you what I did. I did try a couple uh, different uh, size tape. Then I end up just covering these two traces. So we take a while to figure out what traces is uh, are bad. At the first I was looking for what trace it's make the screen looks uh, the best with the lines so I find this uh, this trace here this trace here that's the one is make the screen good colors good but there is uh, a lines and the top half then I start covering the other traces till I find this one that's make the screen completely good so let's uh, show you what the result is Here is the picture. No lines at all. Yeah, the picture looks good. Even if I can close. Yeah, the picture looks good. So if you're wondering what causing the problem, there is a traces here in this area here you can see is is a little bit brighter. Yeah, this spot here. That's what is causing the, the screen to go bad. You can see it, that's the spot here. And if you remember, that's what we find. We have uh, some lines when the, the first try we put the tape. Oh, anyway, that's all the repair uh, can be done. Yeah, the picture looks uh, perfect uh, good.
by the way look like this screen it's been replaced by the Samsung B4 I only see this sticker in the panels that uh, the screen been uh, replaced yeah you can see that's what is the Here, that's the size of the spot. Do you only gonna see it when you have a black screen? So there is a traces over there that's shorted and causing the screen to go off. To go off. So this all for this video. Thank you for watching. See you again.